stock jockey back with you. And the, the lady at the bunker, she's practicing her blacksmith skills and she'll be shoeing horses over the weekend. Oh, is this, a, is this an owner of the bunker issue? No. It's a lady of the bunker issue because I'm the one that has to put up with this. Oh. Uh. I'm the one that has to deal with this. All right, so what we're going to do, gang, is we're going to pour a great big, huge silver bar. And uh, it's going to be so big, we're not, probably not going to be able to weigh it on the scale. It's going to be that big. So... Here we go. Lady the Bunker is trying to figure out how to grab a hot crucible without using her fingers. There's silver melted on here. So it doesn't let me like pick up. Oh well, let's try, right? We can only try. Alright, here we go, gang. Lots of silver. Holy cow! That's a lot of silver dripping out of there. Well, owner of the, bunk, of the bunker said, just leave those other bars in there. <laughs> this looks This like... is what happens when you listen to crazy people. Um. Yeah. Um, I'll, I'll give you a close look at this as soon as the crucible goes further away again. All right, this is cooling off. It looks like your grandma's meatloaf. I mean, if you're thinking about a really nice, smooth, beautiful silver bar. <laughs> hey, everybody likes texture and <laughs> ripples, so. Oh my God. I'm if Kyle also receives this, he's probably going to like nod his head and be like. <laughs> one, more, one more time again. Who, who, who sees this? I'm also. <laughs> you like him, don't you? But I was watching some of his videos, so. All right. He's doing like the little ripples and shaking the table to get it, give it like a different effect. So that was cool. All right. So there you go, Hi-Ho. A little shout out for you. And that's coming from the lady of the bunker to the great bunker in the northwest all right although hi-ho does say that his wife is the original lady bunker, bunker lady and yeah that was one of the um videos i was watching it said something about bunker or something yeah bunker. well bunker bullion's the name of his company Exactly. We're closed. We're closed. Sorry. Alright, so that's getting all cooled off. And it's just a massive meatloaf of silver. And, uh, yeah. So, I guess we cool that off. You're actually going to put two gloves on to try and do this, right? Oh, yeah. There's no way I'm touching that again. Now, is this going to, is this going to go in the, in the French fry rack to cool off? Do you want it to? <laughs> at this point, at this point, I don't know if it really matters. I think you're just wanting to tip it out of there just to... <laughs> yeah. Good luck. How much does it weigh, folks? Well... Let's put it this way. If she put this on the scale, it's too much for our scale right now. It was, um, 6,900 and something grams. Wow. So you can go ahead and do the math on that. That's over six, 
almost seven kilos of silver. That's almost seven kilos of silver. All right, Bunker Lady, you're, gonna, you're actually gonna cool this off if you have some water in there. Oh, you want to go home? It's it's a Friday. You don't you don't have to go it's home. It's Friday. Dude. It's good Friday, but you don't have to go home, dude. No, my brother picked up my kids. Oh, all right. Party. So so <laughs> so okay. Every time I hear stuff like that, I'm thinking, oh my god, I'm just getting buried more and more. It's okay. Yeah. I've already invested a lot into crypto, so I can afford to party. Okay, party here we go. It's uh, dancing. It's doing whatever <laughs> precious metals do when, when they're huge and they're getting pulled off. Were you speechless there? I was speechless there because you, you said something about partying or something and your kids were being taken care of. My kids are always being taken care of. All right, so the french fry basket I think is useless in this. I mean... Yeah, the french fry basket's useless. Lady the Bucket's gonna bring this bar out. By the way, um, yesterday on Steam it, I did something for the first time. I used this application called Steep Shot and uh, put a picture up on one of my postings. And believe it or not, there's a lot of young people, I believe, that like Steep Shot. It's kind of like Instagram, where you just throw pictures up and people just like get all excited. So that was kind of fun yesterday. Try something a little different. What was that? Steep Shot, the name of the app. Steep? Steep, S-T-E-E-P. Oh. Steep Shot. I look into that. And, uh, whoa. All right. So there's that, that meatloaf, loaf of bread, whatever you want to call it. And, uh, It's too bad that we don't have a, a, a logo stamp yet for Lady of the Bunker. This would be this would be a classic first piece to go ahead and <laughs> stamp and, and put the weight on there. No, and see if any, look at, you can see the other bars in here. Yeah, there's other bars that didn't even get melted. I'm going to have to like, yell at my boss or ask him to explain correctly the way his idea is. I don't think I did it the right way. Was this the owner of the bunker that told you to go ahead and just... Melt it, just pour it all together on yeah, bars. Yeah, because normally I do two bars for this because the crucible is not being able to take like the um, seven kilos. So he's like, just do a half and half, and when you pour it on there, the other ones will melt in there, and blah blah blah. So it really isn't going to matter because when when you send or when he sends this off to to get rid of it, it's not going to matter. No, and I have like other silver bars. So oh, okay. we'll probably just end up having uh, the other place melt them all together for us since ours isn't big enough. Alright, so we're going to bring this out front. Like I say, we can't weigh it because it's bigger than the, the capacity of the scale. So, let's go out front and we'll take a look. Make sure you don't drop this one, alright? No, I'm not even, I'm not even going to pick it up, I don't think, because I'm not Are strong. You, we have, Am I strong? I don't even think I'm we strong. Have a scale. Do you actually want do you, do you actually want to weigh it on the on the regular scale just because it show people what it really weighs? Yeah, because this one's gonna go. All right, well, look, just. All right, here here's our regular scale we always use, gang. Lady the Bunker is putting it on there right now, and it exceeds the capacity. Which so, this goes up to six thousand grams. So. So we're gonna go we're gonna go put it on a bigger scale. So you're gonna get a look at this on the bigger scale. And uh, I'm looking at a number on here of like, what, 15? Yeah, but these are different, no? Yeah, this is a, this is a, the ounces this like is a scale, yeah, this is a, the human weighing scale, so. Um, so I guess that would be like 15 pounds that far. And so. It is pretty cool looking though. All right, bring it back out front, lay the bunker, and we'll wrap this thing up a little bit here. 
All right, there it is, gang. Get you one little closer look. And uh, as you can see, there's like two solid bars and the poured silver was melted over the top of it. And there's the other side. And yeah, it's, uh, it's like lifting a barbell. And there's the thickness on the edge. And I don't know anybody that buys a candy bar this big when they go to the store. So we won't, we won't, we won't equate it to any candy bar that anybody's had lately. And there you can see the two solid bars that weren't melted, that were in the mold that the silver was poured over. And then there's the other end of it. And then the back side of the bar. And uh, yeah, Sock Jockey is reminding you to keep on stacking silver bars no matter how, how big they may be. Gold bars, coins, rounds. And while well, the lady of the bunker is finalizing a count for the day, Stock Jockey and Lady of the Bunker are out of here.